today I'm about to come at y'all with something completely different on this channel. As y'all can tell by the title, we're doing my entire perfume collection. This whole bag right here. I don't know if y'all can hear me loud enough because of the fan. If you can't, I'm sorry. But this. This whole entire bag, is 25 pounds bigger than me, is full of nothing but perfume. Y'all, y'all don't even understand the stuff I went through. So, yeah, I have a whole entire perfume collection from Bath and Body Works to Victoria's Secret to some. I don't even know. I got a little bit of everything in here, so yeah, let's hop right into it. I'm breaking out for live. Y'all pray for me, pray for skin. Okay, so first, I think I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to start with Bath and Body Works. Um, yeah, okay, so first from Bath and Body Works, an OG, y'all. If you've never heard of this, never had it, never knew nobody that had it, you live on the rock. Come on now. Pink chiffon. It just she just likes that. I don't really like the lotion, even though I did buy it. But and then I have Delilah. I'm in love with her. I'm in love with her. She was just so good. I have Fiji's. This right here is very much a summer scent. It's giving off vibes i mean vacation florida bahamas like girl and then another og scent y'all another og scent miss sweepy she's a classic she's a classic i feel like she just smells so good this one i want to say it dropped like last year or two years ago i think this is a backup bottle because my other one is basically empty this right here into the night amazing amazing like my, my mom is home she's on the phone now with my sister she's on the tv hey nana boo um i feel like it's getting very much very much cologne i feel like if you haven't heard of this like you have to i don't know Then also, oh my gosh, Bahamas. This is also a summer scent. I got this one when I got Fiji a while ago. Y'all, I got lotion all over the cap. Okay, don't look at it like I'm crazy. But it smells just like pineapple. This one is passion fruit and banana flower. But it smells literally just like pineapple when I had to get the lotion. So you know I got the lotion, girl. Next is A Thousand Wishes. Also an OG scent. Very much a classic. If you never had it, don't have it. Or don't know nobody who has it. You live it under a rock. Come on now. You're the one. I wanted this so freaking bad. I wanted it so bad. And then, like, nobody knew that I actually wanted this, but my roommate, when I was on the mount, Kiki, girl, she had got me one of the little bottles, and I was in love. Girl, I was in love. I was in love. I never bought it because I wasn't sure. Like, it looks like one of them hit or misses, you feel me? Like, it either smell good or it smell like old lady, but girl, it's not good. Another classic, another OG, Velvet Sugar. I've had this bottle as long as I've had the pink chiffon. Um, and I haven't really, for some reason, I haven't really reached for them like that. But yeah, once again, if you don't know about this, you're living under a rock. Next, I have Peace. This is... Bath and Body Works. Um, mm. I don't know why I'm throwing every single one of them. This smells fresh and clean. Like it smells fresh out the shower. It smells like soap, girl. This was their part of their Christmas line. It smells amazing. Rose. I honestly, for me, I'm not a rosy type of style. I don't like the rose scent, girl. I don't. But this right here smells really, really good. I feel like this is honestly the only rose scent that I can like really truly get with. Um, oh, there's one more Bath & Body Works scent that I have in the bathroom. I have more in here. But, um, there's one that I have in the bathroom somewhere. It's the Black Cherry Vanilla. 
I personally don't like that like on maybe just my chemistry I don't like it but on on somebody I feel like I wouldn't like it either it's more of a um like you can use a fabric freshener or like an air freshener but I personally don't like it as a perfume girl and I bought the perfume and the lotion I don't like it so that was a while ago that's when I bought the velvet sugar and the pink chiffon I bought a lot of stuff at the same time that was a few years ago but yeah it's gotten the most use that it's had and I mean because it's used as an air freshener like I said the backup to this one already told y'all about eat. okay so next we have into the stars I need to get another one because when I tell you this one is good it's good summertime you know you're gonna be out you're gonna be hot you're gonna be sweaty excuse me this right here these two right here girl yeah it's not amazing this one gives me more like for some reason a cologne smell and I think yeah that's because of the sandalwood the musk the white argawood and the amber but it smells amazing I personally have one guy that I know that really really likes the smell on that and then yeah that's why it's almost empty but it's cool because it smells good and I like the way it smelled on him so that's why I got it Next is warm vanilla sugar, which is crazy. It said it's made with vanilla extract. Oh, you can tell by the way that vanilla. I don't want to spray it on me because I already have perfume on. But I don't really like the smell of this too much. I mean, it's it's like maybe during the fall or the winter. I like this. I like this so much more. Right now, obviously, it's spring, about to be summer, girl. So I really ain't feeling it. But this one smells like. A lot of alcohol was put into here like it smells like alcohol maybe it's the little bottle but yeah during like the winter and fall months i really be reaching for it last but not least forever red when i tell y'all this smells amazing it smells amazing like it smells amazing Like, as y'all heard, if y'all watched my vacay vlog, I think it was what? I want to say part two? I think, yeah, part two. You heard, I, I told y'all, like, how much, like, how that peony, the vibe peony that I got smells amazing. This one got peony in it. So, if you like peony, pomegranate, it's red peony at that. Some vanilla, the way vanilla rum smell, mm-hmm. And then some oak wood, girl. This smells amazing. Especially in the fall pop this on there's one specific guy that i know that absolutely loves this on me girl left his bed smell like that it's so good. get your damn mind out the gutter all right y'all so next up we got miss victoria's secret pink you know they combine, so we're gonna do them at the same time. All right, so first we have hot petals. Um, well, y'all know how pink like their bottles spray, like they emit, so it's all right, but some of them like they just fully like spray out and it's ridiculous. This right here, I'm not a big fan of, like, it smells like giving very much alcohol, like. I no you know what let me not lie it's one of them it's a season scent it's a it's very much a season scent to be honest when i first got it i mm -mm. no no I, very, I did not like it at all but then it started to grow on me in the summer it's all right let me let me in the summer it's all right but personally i wouldn't wear it no other time unless i knew it was gonna be hot and i needed something that was gonna you know Make sure nobody can smell no sweat. You feel me? Cause you know it'd be hot, you be sweating. You be like, uh-huh. You feel me? Mm -mm. And then next, what I would prefer over this right here for sweat. Well, if you don't, if you know you're gonna be sweating, what I prefer over this, fresh and clean. It's good. I got the body wash, the lotion, the mist. I got the baby one of this. Lifesaver for the summer. 
Like, this is something that a man could wear. Like, it's, it's giving very much Irish spring. It smells good. Um, I don't know. Don't, don't, not like fully Irish spring, you feel me? But like, it's, it gives very much Irish spring. Like, it smells. I cannot tell, y'all. You know how like Irish Spring gives off that fresh and clean scent? I mean, it really depends on your chemistry, on your chemistry cause sometimes it be smell like right old man. But like, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I mean. It's fresh, clean, mask in the sweat, right in the sweat, punch it in the face, you feel me? Yeah. Okay. And then warm and cozy. I don't know why I gotta smell it so warm. Warm and cozy. be honest it's really a hit or miss depending on the day and you know yeah i prefer this at night and please use it with the, with the body wash i mean if you have a body wash that like really like you can mix with this scent then do it but i got the body wash the lotion the baby scent as well that's the baby scent the baby bottle it's not a baby bottle the smaller bottle you know what i mean and the body wash lotion this bottle and this smaller bottle same for this i got these both at the same time i got um all four pieces of each because yeah i got um this right here exotic so i want to say this is i want to say this was discontinued i mean it smells a little old. i don't know my grandmother had gave me this I haven't found, I feel like I could find like a lotion like to go with this. I mean, it smells a little classy, but you have to let it sit for a minute. When you first spray it on, it's overwhelming, it's strong. But once you let it sit inside, it smells okay. Next, the honey perfume. Um, I don't like it. As you can tell, I don't like it. Um, the body wash is okay, but I have to have the body wash with a vanilla scent, um, perfume and lotion. The lotion for this? No, ma'am. <laughs> Lastly, we got the cherry elixir and the berry elixir. I think that's how you say it. Number 33, number 68. The bottles looked so, the bottles are beautiful they're beautiful so when i seen these i was like oh yeah girl like they gotta smell good they gotta smell good like i thought this one was gonna get very much you know like darker scents cologne which it does it really does but i feel like i won't pull these out maybe until fall or summer you can tell i don't really use these um yeah i got on me i like this one honestly i feel like this one could i could use this this time of year but i would mainly you know pull for it in the fall or the summer now girl the cherry looks good y'all know the cherry car scent i know you do it's you know it's giving very much old been sitting in the car musty crusty and dusty needs to go in the trash stinky well, i just don't like it like which is so weird i think the quiet mystery the black cherry i can smell the cherry the cherry smells good the liquid amber i don't really smell the amber and it has quiet mystery whatever the hell quiet mystery is they need to throw it in the trash so i thought that the elixirs were last girl i was wrong victoria's secret untamed this is I said Victoria's Secret. Pure Seduction Untamed. I want to say this is my second bottle of this. I think they discontinued this and then bring it back um, during the winter of last year. And I don't feel like it's giving what it gave before they discontinued it. Like, yeah, the bottle is beautiful. The bottle that they have before this beautiful girl but it's not the same as last year y'all done messed up again 
I thought the pure seduction was last and it's not but the pure seduction crystal I also have that too um I haven't reached for this in a minute but I feel like it smells something it smells like something else that I have I just don't know what it is This is something that I could, mm, I don't know. I'm trying to think of what it smells like, but I can't figure it out. And I'm not going through every single one of these perfumes to figure it out. But yeah, this smells nice. I think I mix this and then warm and cozy together when I spray it and it smells bomb. But other than that, that's finally it for the Victoria's Secret portion for this. So next we have all the miscellaneous perfumes. Okay, so these are, I think, these are by Ed Hardy. These are here. I mean, these smell really good. You can get these at Dollar General, I think. That's where my grandpa got them for me from for our Christmas present. I love me got me a whole set. Um, I like them as a air freshener, which is mainly this one. You can tell because it's almost gone. But then, this one I mainly use as a body mist. They smell good. I feel like to be able to like use them at least for me, I need to use the body wash and the lotion and the body mist because I don't think I could really mix them with anything else to be honest with you. And then Calgon. Girl Calgon, you can get it at Walmart, I believe. Target, I think. I don't know. But I feel like this is such a classic too. You can tell I've had this bottle for a minute and so I've not finished it. This one is the Hawaiian ginger. It is such a classic and it smells. amazing so next this right here kimberly sweet peach i think personally i think this one smells like um hawaiian ginger i feel like it has some of the same notes as hawaiian ginger but it smells really really good this right here girl this pretty bottle five dollars five them below we're gonna go get it Next, I also have, I believe this is Sweet Cherry, maybe, or Cherry Bomb, or something, as you can see. I've had it for so long. Oh, come on, me. Yeah, Sweet Cherry by Kimberly as well. I made it the same person from the same place. Bob Malo, Fire House, girl. It smells amazing. I went in looking for this. Oh, my gosh, it smells so good. This girl, college, college parties, wear this almost every single night. Um, this smells amazing. Pair this right here with Cherry Almond by Jerkins. Amazing. Like, I'm almost out of it, so I really need to stop spraying it. I went to go look for the five below. They have nothing but the tester. Next is Sugar Rush by Aeropostale. I'm wearing this today. I've had this for a few years. This smells absolutely amazing. Um, I can say it doesn't, the sugar kind of gives you like a little childish scent, but then you also have whatever else, whatever other notes, because they don't have them on here that are in here. You know what, I want to look up the notes for y'all, because I don't even know the notes, but it gives like, um, a little childish, but a little mature scent to it. Really? This is what they're saying the notes are, but I low-key doubt it is caramel red berries floral notes musk pomegranate and white woods the only thing i feel like i might be able to smell is the pomegranate the red berries and the floral notes i don't smell any other woodsy notes like i don't even smell like caramel so i don't know okay so next i have the very romantic for femmes um i believe these came from family dollar to be honest i didn't get these i got these as a christmas gift from someone but um yeah like at first it was given very much a woman but then i got used to it and i actually kind of like the smell of it um i feel like it's something that everybody would love not everybody would like but mm, it gives low-key old woman Slash really mature. I don't know, but I like it. Okay, so next is this Vita Vita. Girl, once again, five and blows. This right here is a knockoff Juicy Couture of. I'm gonna believe a lot, Juicy. 
I think it might be Be Bala Juicy. But it's a knockoff of Juicy Couture. And if you've watched my vacay vlogs, girl, you know I got 11 for Juicy Couture. And it's not. 10 out of 10 recommend. Five below. Five dollars. Okay, so next I have these two perfumes right here. Um, These are from, I think I got these two at Family Dollar. Because they look like knockoffs of Victoria's Secret. And I'm thinking Love Spell and Pure Seduction is what they were supposed to smell like. This one, it gives Love Spell. Um, I honestly feel like it's a, it's more intense than Love Spell. So, save the coin. Just go to Family Dollar. Just, just go. Um, and then this one was supposed to be, I guess, Pure Seduction. Is giving very much man like this one's like something that should be on a man it's called fireworks and it don't smell like that so yeah recommend this one recommend this to your husband this right here came straight from dollar tree girl it's a whole knockoff of um tommy girl by tommy hill figure and i'm not sure how that smells we're gonna have to look into that but this is also one of them scents for the summer i feel like it can smell good on either a man or a woman girl dollar let me not lie and say dollar dollar 25 at dollar tree they need to get it together i can tell you right now it does not last that long but if you're just looking for something simple that you can maybe even keep in your car as a backup person just you should forget it yeah but also no because i wouldn't mix this with every single lotion or body wash that you have i feel like it would have to be something light maybe like the lotion refreshing clean lotion i don't know but you're really gonna have to figure out what they mix this with because to be honest with you i don't even know the only thing i might actually mix it with would be the lotion and the body wash for fresh and clean then i have poor poudre yeah so this right here smells absolutely amazing i told y'all about this in my vacay vlog part two come to find out this right here is a dupe for the chanel perfume i can't think of which one i i don't know which one it is but these i think there's multiple they're, Ch they're dupes for chanel and i didn't know that until i was watching i think it was um I went through and I watched an old video of Chloe Yasmin's, um, and she was talking about this perfume right here, and I, it's a whole dupe. I think we got the same one, but it smells really good. Like, it smells amazing. I haven't really reached for it because I want to find another bottle because it's so easy. It's been so easy to go through this. I've only used this a handful of times, and y'all, I spray a lot of perfume because I need it to last. You know what I mean? throughout the day this is what happens so i can't have no little bottles on them so next y'all also seen this one by brioni by the good scent i raved about this on there um in vacay vlog too this smells so good like it's so sweet yet so mature like it's just it smells so good i haven't worn this one in a while either because yeah i only use this one a handful of times as well just to keep myself from using this one and that knockoff Chanel, go ahead been in the living room and not the bathroom. Because I would have been using it all. You know what I mean? Last but not least, y'all. Last but not least. I wasn't going to go through all these, but then I was like, you know what? I might as well. So these are all Juicy Couture scents, and I absolutely love them. Not all of them, but some of them. All right, y'all, so Viva La Juicy. As you can see, I have the knockoff, the dupe of that. I, like, have nothing else in here, but I can tell y'all if it really... Yeah, this literally smells like the knockoff one. And I was gonna buy... I might just buy the Juicy Couture bottle. You see how small these are, though? These things are so tiny. They're so small. It's like the size of my pinky. And I got small hands. 
Yeah, these smell the same. This one's empty, but I like keeping these until I get the actual bottle of Juicy Couture. And then I give it away. I give it away, but throw it away. Okay, and then this is Vita La Juicy La Flor. I think Flor? Flor? I don't know. Anyway, this one also smells good, and you can probably tell because of the fact that there's literally nothing in here. I like using these as extra spray, so when I spray on one perfume, I usually just do it on my neck, I'll do it on my arms and the inside of my elbows, the back of my knees, my ankles, stuff like that, and it smells amazing. Oh my gosh, bra bra broke. <sighs> Girl, tell me why I went to Walmart. They're selling juice you could do on Walmart. They were showcasing this, advertising it, whatever thing. I go to look, they don't even have it. Y'all, whoever y'all is in Milford, I don't live in Milford by the way, but whoever it is in Milford that ran through the aisle and snatched up the juice store. Eat dirt. But yeah. This right here, amazing. If y'all know where to find these, let me know because I need to go get them. Um, also orange. I think I also like this one. Yeah, I like this one because it was really zesty. It gives off low-key cologne, but also really mature. Okay, now I love Juicy Couture. My nose is burning, y'all. I'm about to start spraying this way. It's, there's half of it left, so. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I don't even know what that smells like, but that's something that I would not. Mm -mm. That explains why there's over half of it left. Um, palm tree, please. I think this one smells really good. Once again, basically empty. Yeah, I like this one. It's given like a fresh scent. And like it almost smells like this, but there's something else in there. That's like, I don't know. But it smells really good. Oh my gosh, Viva La Juicy Gold Edition. Y'all, I'm gonna spray that in my eye. Well, no, I didn't, because I ain't nothing to spray. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to tell you how it smells. This smells really good as well. It's like the intensified version of Viva La Juicy. There's so many. Juicy Couture has so many different versions of Evil Juicy. I think they got Intense, they got the Floor, they have the Gold Edition, they got the regular one. Um, yeah, there's just a lot of a lot. I am Juicy Couture. I think this one I might have liked this one, but there is some left. That burned my nose so bad. I should do better doing it. I got allergies. It smells like baby powder. It smells like if there was an intense, if there was an intense version of baby powder, this would be it. All right, y'all. So that is it for my whole entire perfume collection. This video is gonna be like I've been recording for like 40 minutes now. That is so ridiculous. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Let me know what else y'all wanna see. Whether it has to do with lifestyle, um, hygiene things like this anything else y'all need to dm me give me some suggestions i put a poll on instagram the other night not a poll i let y'all like i put a little question thing on instagram last night how y'all ask me like or tell me what y'all wanted to see y'all don't really reply i mean there's a handful y'all thank y'all who do and i will be taking y'all suggestions i'll be running with them but i love y'all i hope y'all enjoyed this video and i will see y'all in the next one.